A powerful system bringing heavy rain and snow is bearing down on Southern California right now. This is video from Studio City about an hour ago. You can see the hail coming down. We have team coverage on the mess of the storm is causing in our area. We're going to begin with meteorologist Dallas Rains tracking the latest conditions. That's right, Ellen. This is part two of the storm. We've had uh, funnel clouds along the coastline, heavy rain. You saw that hail from Studio City and more rain is coming down tonight. Let's go to the live Mega Doppler. You can see the rain along the coastline. We've had lightning strikes in Santa Barbara as this weather system moves through. If you're viewing from the South Bay right now, there's a band of heavy rain coming on shore. If you look outside to the west, you'll see that a dark cloud that's rotating your direction up on the five. Now it's all about the snow coming down as we get closer. You can see the CHP is escorting through the grapevine due to the fact that we're getting heavy snow in that area and that's going to stay that way all night long. Now let's look along the foothill communities. Heavy rain from the Sierra Madre area, Glendora, all the way across Rancho Cucamonga. And then above that, at about 5,000 feet, it is snowing quite heavily. Pomona, Chino, all of our friends out there, get ready. Gusty winds. And down in the OC, boy, this thing came on shore a few minutes ago and it moved through Laguna Niguel with heavy rain. Very concerned about that area because they picked up about a half inch to three quarters of an inch of rain and gusty winds in about a 30 minute period. Still more action going on there. And when we look at the radial velocity of the radar, we can still see there is circulation in that cloud. Doesn't mean a tornado is coming, but there is circulation, and we're watching that carefully for you, too. The complete forecast in just a minute, David and Ellen. All right, Dallas, we'll see you then. The storm creating problems for residents from flooding and possible mudslides to downed trees and treacherous driving conditions. Eyewitness News reporter Leanne Suter joins us live from Pasadena with more. Leanne? Ellen and David, the rain picking up once again here in Pasadena. We were enjoying a slight break, at least in the amount of rain that was falling, but it's starting to pick up again. And as you said, this latest storm once again causing problems all across the area. A sudden downpour in Pasadena as the latest round of rain hits Southern California. I'm ready for a run outside, maybe with some sun and uh, without an umbrella. A similar scene in Riverside as heavy rain and strong winds whip through the Inland Empire. A raging river of muddy runoff in the Cajon Pass catching several drivers by surprise. The man behind the wheel of this SUV was swept away by the fast-moving water. Luckily, he'll be okay. This semi ended up stuck. San Bernardino County Fire's Swiftwater Rescue Team helping him out. It's been pretty heavy. And most of the creeks are looking like this, so I'm worried about going across. Up in the San Bernardino Mountains, the wicked weather are creating dangerous driving conditions as more snow continues to fall. And in Mar Vista, this massive tree came crashing down on several cars. I don't think we still need it, but a lot of people want to see the sunshine again. But me personally, I love it. In Orange County, crews continuing to keep a close eye on the San Clemente hillside, which gave way last week. And up in the grapevine, traffic is moving now, but the CHP warning that could quickly change. Um, it is wet out there. Not right now. We are not shutting the freeway down, but there is a potential for tonight uh, with the snow levels dropping a little bit more. And that snow is falling heavy in the grapevine. The CHP now running escorts through the area, so be warned. They say that if it does start to pick up, if that snow level picks up and it really starts to stick, they could be shutting down the grapevine. Live in Pasadena, Lee Yam Suter, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.